Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you hear my voice sound different, it's because I got a cold, but I have to get this video out. So I'm gonna start off with my eyebrows first, and I'm gonna brush them out with a spoolie. And I really need a wax really, really bad. So don't judge me. And now I'm taking the LA Colors Auto Eyeliner in the color black brown. And I like to use the eyeliner better than uh, eyebrow pencil because it's more creamier and it glide on way easier and the color is perfect for my eyebrows plus it's makeup so you can use whatever you want to use and your CV keeps stopping I'm talking to Eric I'm actually helping him do his homework while I record and yeah this is like a real raw um makeup tutorial this is what i go through almost every day because i am a single parent erica's mostly always with me so if you see me stopping and all that it's because i'm talking to eric and helping with his homework so i'm just lightly filling in my eyebrows um nothing too much too heavy because i'm going i'm not going for a natural look but i don't want to look like too beat i'm going for something very very simple and I'm gonna brush them out with the spoolie again. And this bang dog was really getting on my nerves. This a whole video. You'll see me keep pushing it out of my face. Now I'm going with the LA Colors 18 color eyeshadow. And I'm using that um, purple shade. It's like a plum purple shade. And this palette is, it don't, it's not a bad palette, but it's not, it don't give you a lot of a color like it's not pigmented at all you got to build up the color and I'm using this fluffy fluffy <laughs> fluffy blending brush from wet and wow I got it from Dollar Tree I believe it was only like a dollar and they it's pretty good I really love them I got like two or three of them I use them all the time in all my tutorials so Go to Dollar General and get you a lot of these wet and white brushes. They're really good. In that same palette, I'm using that pink shimmery shade and I'm just gonna place it on the, the lid of my eye. And I'm using a flat eyeshadow brush to do this. And I'm gonna take that same fluffy brush that I used from earlier and just blend the product out so it can have a smooth transition and for my primer I'm going to use the elf poreless face primer and Cake, my dog, she too off the top, so I have to open it up and use a flat um, foundation brush to apply it. And then I'm gonna blend everything out with my fingers. And this primer is really, really good. It leaves your face like not minty, but like it's smooth and like refreshing. Like I really can't explain it. You gotta actually use the product to know what I'm talking about. I'm going to conceal first and I found out that if I do do it this way instead of doing the foundation first I use less product. So for the concealer I'm using the LA Color Concealer and I also got this I think from Dollar Tree it was a dollar. It's not it don't really give you that much coverage that's why you'll see me going in with the LA Girl Pro Conceal HD High Definition Concealer in the color Warm Sand and I actually mix it under my eyes only and I'm helping Eric again and I'm gonna put it under my eyes the bridge of my nose my cupid's bow and my chin now I'm gonna apply the foundation and I'm using the Maybelline fit me matte poreless and this one is in the color 360 mocha and I'm gonna put a couple of dots all over my face and 
blend everything down with a beauty sponge. I just started using it but it's it blends out really nicely and it, it's a perfect contour color for me. To set my face, I'm using the Profusion Contour Palette and I'm taking the lightest color to set under my eyes where everywhere where I highlight it. And then I'm going to take the darkest shade for my contour. This contour palette came with three brushes, a mirror, three dark colors to contour a bronze, three light colors to highlight, and two actually highlight colors. One is like a golden color and the other one is like a champagne. So bomb, you guys. Fine and now for Marshall. my face I'm taking this no more blemish pressed powder from RK by Kiss in the color chestnut and I'm taking this thick fluffy brush from Wet n Wild. I also got this brush from Dollar Tree for a dollar. Mm -hmm. To set my face I'm using the Wet n Wild Photo Focus matte finish set and spray and I got this from Forever 21 for about $7.99 For highlight I'm taking that champagne color out of the Profusion Contour Palette and this is one of the brushes that came with the palette
lipstick. I'm using the Cream Luscious Triple Butter Matte Cream from Ruby Kisses. And I cannot tell you the name because I had it so long until the lady done pulled off. But it's just, you can use any pink matte color. And I'm going to line my lips with the same brown eyeliner that I use for my brows. And this is my first time doing this. I usually don't line my lips at all. But I wanted to try something new and it came out pretty good. And to top it off, I use just like a cotton candy lip gloss. And it's very thick. <laughs> so, this is the finished look, you guys. So this is the final look. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed making it. And I hope to see you in my next video. Yeah.